what we do here is go back, 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 back. My name is Jonathan Brumfield. I am a program manager for the program called Get Active, House at Safe Passages. So the Get Active program is an urban arts curriculum-based program. We center it around direct action through visual art. One of the main things that we focus on is taking the art form of spray can art and focusing that actual attention into social justice. So any social justice issues that come up for not only our young people, but for their families, we sit down and create imagery and actual messages that coincide with those issues. So the after school programs were kind of the alternative to the during the school day programs, where some kids were getting in trouble and didn't want to come to school, but because of the urban arts curriculum and get active, they came to school because they couldn't wait till after school to get to get active. Urban arts is not looked at as urban arts by the general public, it's looked at as graffiti. Graffiti is a word that criminalizes an actual visual art form, and so we wanted to show not only the kids and the families, but the general community that we live in, that this is an actual art form that has a voice and speaks to issues that a lot of people aren't trying to address. And if used appropriately and correctly, it can also create an economy for your family, but it also can create a voice where there was no voices before. Seeing that a lot of young people weren't having fun when it came to art classes or anything that had to do with the art. So I felt like, well, if I can introduce something that all of them have access to, it's a spray can, then I think it'll be fun for them, one, but two, they'll know that they can actually do something with their hands that normally people would be saying is a crime. A lot of times, the community is used to people coming in and telling them what they need and what they should have, and say, passages came into the community asking, what do people want? And what should we do as an organization to provide that? All the kids ask me, what's your goal for this class? So I say, for you to be better than me. Right now, all the kids that were sixth graders that I taught are seniors, and they're all graphic designers, they're making clothes for other people's clothing brands, they're getting paid to do murals more than I do, and that was my goal, for them to actually go further than what I did with Urban Arts. I think the biggest goal for me is to see one of the young people that's come through Get Active become the program manager of Get Active, and for all the young people that he was in class with, or she was in class with, to be the mentors and counselors and case managers.